Welcome everybody to Warzone. This is Call of Duty's new Battle Royale and it is absolutely amazing. But real quick before we drop in, leave a like if you do enjoy this Warzone video and if you want to see more Warzone. I don't have many friends to play with right now. I haven't convinced my friends to actually download this. It is free to play for everyone. You can download it in uh, the PlayStation Store, the Xbox Store, and on Battle.net even if you don't have it. So I am in with a normal squad and they want to go Superstore. So I guess that's where we're going to go. So, I mean... I'm loving this so far. The only issue that I've had with this is that solos isn't a thing yet, and that's really bad for the times that I want to play by myself. But other than that, I'm enjoying it. I know this intro was very abrupt, but we're hopping in here, starting off right away. There's a lot of people here, so I'm going to go off to the buildings towards here. Maybe this one looks nice. Okay, we got cash. There's a contract have a shotgun and a crate and I mean the, the graph graphic wise it's not really built for console it doesn't seem like especially considering they're also trying to push for 200 players and oh my god that was the most abrupt intro that I've ever done I'm not used to doing that that was a lot oh my god I like I completely forgot what I wanted to say as well because we just hopped straight into it but I mean we're here we're playing warzone that's how it is and someone was already here. This is terrifying. Okay, I'm just going to stick with this one dude. Oh, he's already leaving me. <laughs> oh, man. Well, he's going to secure the thing. I'm just going to take this time to probably loot these little farmhouses. Because this is the airport. Yeah, this is the airport right here. I will let you guys know. Like, I will fill you, fill you in on my future video plans. Um, I do have a Fortnite video that's going to be coming out soon on, um, like, a dropper in creative. Um, so I'm, I'm still gonna be doing Fortnite, but I am gonna be mixing Call of Duty Warzone into it. I feel like just Battle Royale just suits my channel now, so pr pretty much any Battle Royale, but mainly Fortnite and Warzone right now. I, I also plan to do uh, a video on Plunder as well, the one, the brand new game mode other than Battle Royale, which I've only played once. I've only played the game mode once, and it's actually pretty fun. I am kind of just like taking the time to get better at warzone in general especially with it being only three-man squads right now and me always playing by myself i'm trying to ah ah yikes don't even i don't just kill me just kill me it's fine just kill me i'm sitting here trying to talk but... now the thing is that's the only issue i've been having with this with that guy even if I could have handled him, there were still like one or two more guys behind him that I would have to deal with. And I had no armor whatsoever. But we're in the gulag now. And it's my time to 1v1. Let's go, dude. Easy. Let's go. We're coming back in. I do want to start streaming this. Like eventually and then use those stream highlights for videos. But the thing is, I'm thinking about, I'm trying to think about what platform I should stream on. Should I stream on Twitch? Should I stream on YouTube? I might do a community tab poll to figure out what you guys would think is best. Got that. New pistol. Got that. Got dead silence. Also, I was thinking about do. I gotta write down a bunch of video ideas that I've been having for Warzone. I wanna do uh, some uh, controller settings videos, like the best controller settings for you to do. Because I have it, usually the default version of picking up items is usually where you would have to hold to swap. But for me, it's just tap because I changed something. So if you guys want me to show you how to do that, I definitely can. Just leave a like on the video, like I said. And I'm hoping this video gets a good reception because I would love to start making Warzone videos. The only thing, unfortunate thing is, for now, I need to make sure that I record with friends because this solo thing, if I'm going to keep dying over and over again, it's kind of boring. You know, one thing you guys gotta know is that whenever I come to a decision of, like, between Call of Duty, like, what I like more or what I want to play, Call of Duty versus Fortnite, I hope you guys know that I'm always gonna be choosing Call of Duty, because Call of Duty is what I grew up with, and oh my god, we got a beautiful chest. That's mine. That's mine. Oh my god. See, this is actually perfect for me. With me going against three-man squads, my guys already died and left, which I was gonna get them back, but... You know, I'm on my own now. I could, so since I'm technically in the circle, I could get on one of these rooftops and become a rooftop sniper, which would be really good for myself. And let me grab it. 
There's someone. If I can hit my shots, that'd be really nice. You've got a loadout drop inbound. Loadout drops coming in. Where is that coming in at? There's people right over there. I guarantee it. God, where are they? Look, that's that's the crazy thing about Warzone. With 150 players, you you don't know where people are. You'll hear gunshots in the distance, but they won't pop up on the minimap. And you'll be like, where the hell are they? Because when they do shoot, their their things do pop up on the minimap. I'm gonna come over here and I'm gonna see what exactly they're doing and see how I could third party this. Looks like they're fighting over in that building. I see them. I decided to shoot. Okay. Rogue's armor. Take that. I see you still. Hold on, let me get into the train so I can reload. I got some shots off of him. Maybe wasted, let him waste his armor. Just gotta use this just so I can move silently. You know, I'm gonna get up as close as I can to them with that silence. There's one. Baby. No one's here. Oh my god, we cleared them out. Let's go, bro. That's what I'm talking about. We did it, boys. We cleared them out. Oh, there's another guy coming. I'm gonna flank around the spot that I saw him at. Push out here to see what the hell he's doing, because I saw those gunshots, but I didn't hear him. Did he just... Yeah, they're shots. Definitely shots. There's one. Yo, come on. I heard him too. Oh, that was, oh man. See, that's the thing. And if it was in solos, I would have made it out of there alive because there probably would have only been one person there. We got our SMG sniper combo. And we are making our way towards this one end of the airport to try to track down these two people that were near here. But the thing is, I've never been to this airport, so I don't know. Like, I've never landed here. So I don't really know where I'm going. Gosh. There they are. I thought they saw me. But I, I literally, as I was about to, like, as I was about to say something, I was about to say that I don't like being in that open area because I'm so vulnerable. And, of course, those guys appeared and I think they know where I am. Okay, it doesn't even matter. See, that's 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 the thing. If it wasn't three man squads, I had them. I had them. I, I beat them. But when people have full armor, it's and there's three people pressuring you, it's impossible for you to get something done. Why can't battle royale games just start off with solos? This really makes me depressed. And like, yeah, you know, Warzone has had their fair share of matchmaking issues and um, bugs. 
But here's the thing. The main thing that they desperately need to fix is that there's no solos. There needs to be solos. I cannot stress this enough. There needs to be solos. You cannot expect everyone to be able to play with someone. Stop throwing rocks at me, you assholes. Doesn't matter. I'm coming back in, boys. I'm coming back in. Let's go. Bro, I'm so Here's I played a lot of gunfight, so I'm really good at the gulag. I'm like undefeated in the gulag. No, that's a lie. <laughs> They're over there. Now, once I do get close, instead of scouting out with the thermal, I am going to throw this recon drone, and that's the reason why I grabbed it. So I could scout this area once I do get over here. Oh, no, no. Putting on one armor, I'm gonna have to finish him. That was a good play. I mean, they were already. Yeah, see, there's three more, and then they're already fighting again. So I would have died anyway. So, well, um. That was, that was crazy. So if you guys did enjoy this video, be sure to leave a like for more Warzone, subscribe to the channel, and turn notifications on to be notified every time I upload another video like this one. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys later.